but this shit right here, that's more than like 300 pounds. Alexa, play J. Cole on Spotify. This is J. Cole from Spotify. Turn it up. Play Justin Bieber on Spotify. I'll settle for the ghost to you. I follow the instructions. I usually, I usually, I usually don't read instructions at all because I read the instructions. But yeah, no, I, 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 I had, I have a screw that I don't know where it goes. Let's hope I don't fall off this shit. Boom, I'm done. Honestly, this bed was too easy to put together. Gang, gang, what's up? Kind of looks like a prison bed right now. Is she cute? Is she cute for now? Did I put this backwards? I, I don't care. You know what? I don't care. Can I put water? I mean milk in a coffee machine? Can I put milk in a coffee machine? While it may seem convenient to replace water with milk in a coffee maker, it actually may cause more harm than good. Good to motherfucking know. Bro, my hair is a mess right now. Bro, I had bought this bread. And you know that bread that tastes like ass? Like, okay, it doesn't taste like ass because I never ate ass. I never ate ass. Cause I like healthy bread, you know? Like I like 12 grain bread. I'm sorry, excuse my hair right now. But you know that, that bread that's like healthy bread but you could taste that it's healthy bread cause it tastes like ass? I accidentally, I accidentally bought that and I wanna cry. Like I know I'm not supposed to be like wasting food or whatever, but I'm not eating this. Rye bread, like what? what who do I look like? It does not usually sound like this. I don't know what's going on, but I'm gonna ignore that. What am I gonna wear? Oh, I know what I'm gonna wear. I have a few things that I wanna do. Like, I wanna go to the thrift store real quick. And then I wanna go to Ross to see if I can find a bed set. I gotta do something to my hair, bro. Cause what is this? Yo, you know when you have like an outfit in mind and you like don't know how it's gonna look? Let's try it out though. I've been wearing bras recently because every time I wear a bra, it looks like I have titties. Wait, is this bed even sturdy? I'm, yo, excuse this right here. We just moved in, bro. Okay, so this is the outfit I had in mind, y'all. You ready? It's cute, it's cute. My hair. I'm gonna fix that, I swear. So this is just like a black little romper that I got on Shein. But, oh, I think my coffee ready. Mmm, smells delicious. Why does it not look bad here? This mug is corny as fuck. I need to give me a cooler mug. Good morning, beautiful. Shut the hell up. Hold on, let me enter this DM real quick. I'm curling it. Curling it. Curling it. I'm curling it. Ah! I don't understand why I keep dyeing my hair like from blonde to brown to blonde to brown. I can't decide which one I like. Like, there was a point where I was like, I'm just gonna dye half of my hair blonde and the other half brown because I can't decide which one I want to do. Cause the blonde looks good on me. Like I like how the blonde looks and I'm not gonna lie, I get a little crazy when I'm blonde. I really don't know why blonde brings out the worst in me, but um, it damages my hair too much, like way too much. My hair falls out, like I shed like crazy, bro. My blonde hair will be like all over my shirt and like all over like my back and I don't see it. And then people are like, girl. <laughs> but then when I have dark hair, like my hair goes healthy right away. Like my hair goes from being crusty, dusty, musty, to like, oh my god, it's healthy. Like how and why? It doesn't make sense, cause it's the same hair. Maybe it's mental. I need to buy long sleeves for the gym because I've been getting too confident recently and I've just been pulling up in like bras. And I'm like literally a small ass sports bra. I'll pull up to the gym and be like, okay. But I need to chill. Cause I have days where I don't feel that good and then all I have are little tiny ass shirts. Okay, is this better? Let me go see. It's a little better. Sorry, that is so gross. Excuse me. Um, I'm just putting in some argan oil, you know, for a shine or whatever. You know what's really annoying to me? When I leave somebody on red for like a minute, by a minute I mean like a few days, and then I answered a few days after, and then they leave me on red back. Like, bruh, that shit is so disrespectful. So disrespectful! Okay, I'll let y'all know when I'm ready. So, am I the only one that is like super weird about wearing black shoes with like any other color socks that aren't black? Like, I'm literally gonna change into black socks because of that. And I can't wear like black socks with white shoes. Like I just think it's wrong. I think it's dirty. I think it's, like, why would you do that? I cut bangs because I thought that that's what I wanted in my life. So I have bangs. I'm definitely giving like 70s, right? <laughs> and it doesn't match me at all, but I thought it was gonna be like groundbreaking for me. But now I hate them and I try to hide them. Let me show y'all what my recent makeup routine has been because it's been mad simple. And I don't usually put on makeup to leave my house, but I've been trying to recently. I'm trying to be more girly. I'm trying to be more girly, okay? 
If I had eyelashes on, I, would, I wouldn't I would do this much. So first thing I'm gonna do, curl my eyelashes. Mascara. I really wanna grow my eyelashes cause I've been wearing eyelashes for like two years now, like nonstop. <laughs> but they're growing, they're, they're thriving. And then I'm gonna do eyebrows. I look like my name is Brad. It's because of my bangs, dude. Why did I do that? And then the last step is just highlighter. Like, I don't do anything else but highlighter and then, like, some chapstick or, like, lip gloss. It depends what mood I'm in. I do highlighter everywhere on my face. Like, literally everywhere. That's my that's my makeup routine recently, boy. It changes every motherfucking day. But this week, that's what it's been. Okay? Lip gloss. Perfume. My rings. This is the whole process, bro. Mm, I'm gonna do this one here. Okay, see y'all later. Don't look at me like that. It's it's Friday. It's cheat day. I don't deserve a motherfucking cheat day, but I'm gonna take it. I was craving a chicken sandwich. I was gonna get one from Chick Fil A, which is like you know the best chicken sandwich. Obviously. The drive was too long, and I wasn't trying to do that today. I'm gonna eat my chicken sandwich. Ow, bro, my quads hurt so bad, which is good. I love that, but like, damn. I'm about to eat my chicken sandwich, and then I'll show you guys everything that I bought. Mind your business. Yes, I still eat and love mayo with everything. Absolutely, 100%. I used to mention in like almost all of my videos that like I love mayo and I still motherfucking do, I don't care. Can't tell if I deserve this or not, but all I can tell you is that I am happy. It really triggers me to eat like this because as you guys know, um, I went through a weight loss journey. It's crazy because like I don't have any vivid memory looking like this. Like I just don't remember when I did. Even though it was six months ago. But now, every time I eat like this, I feel like her. I take care of myself. I eat good six days of the week. I'm at the gym every day for like two hours, six to seven days a week. I'm gonna enjoy my motherfucking chicken sandwich, coke, and fries. And that's just that on that. I'm gonna die. It's only been 10 minutes since I ate that and I'm already guilty about it. I'm trying not to be. I'm really trying to be better when it comes to that. Feeling guilty after eating something like that because that's how you have setbacks and you feel guilty about it sometimes. You know what, you're a human being and <laughs> you have setbacks. I had a Chipotle bowl yesterday, which I guess is like kind of cheating, but is it really? No. Therefore, therefore, I think I am allowed. Good little, good little chicken sandwich, you know? <laughs> Sorry. Something about being in this position, like when you're like, on your tippy toes and like squatting down. It's really sexual to me and I don't know what it is. Like I don't know how to explain it. Okay, anyway, let me show you what I got. First thing I got was this white cover, covers, white covers for my bed because right now I have a gray one and like I like it. I feel like for more like fancy vibes, more like put together vibes, white just looks better. I need a pee! Oh my God, I'm wearing a romper, fuck. I have to get like butt ass naked just to pee. Oh my God. I'm gonna do so much cardio today at the gym. I got the comforter at Ross, by the way. And at Ross, I also got this white, 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 black sports bra. I already have this. I got it literally at Ross, and it's the same exact thing that I already have. I have attachment issues with things that I really like. So I buy a lot of them so that I, I just in case. Just in case. I really want to find one of these in red because I love these so much. And then let me show you guys what I got at the thrift. Ow! I got this little glass thing that I want to put my rings in. This was like a dollar, bro. And it was 50% off, so it was like 50 cents. I'm going to put all my rings in here because I have a lot of rings and I'll just like keep that next to my bed or whatever. And I told y'all I needed long sleeves for like the gym and shit. I got this one. Yeah, I got this one. It's Vineyard Vines. A little whale hoe right here and it's such like a nice material. I want to wear a long sleeve today because after eating that chicken motherfucking sandwich, I can't wear nothing like this to the gym. Not today. Dude, this man stay double texting me. Oh, okay, sorry. And then I also got this in gray. It's like a button down and it's super big to wear with like some booty shorts. I got this one and I love it. The material, bro. This feels so, like you know this feels soft. And I could also wear this to sleep on the days that, that I don't wear it to the gym. Obviously the days that they're not, it's not dirty. I thought I was gonna like this more than, more than I do. I got something super similar in black. The material's a little thicker, but I like it anyway. So this is what it looks like. It's obviously huge, gigantic. And then I got this hat. I am so, wait. I'm so happy I found this. I've been wanting a brown hat for a minute. And I found this one. It's brown! Like, tell me this is so cute. I'm so sorry for burping so much. I had Coke. I don't usually drink soda. 
I haven't had Tola in like four months. Love it. This was five dollars, bro. This red shirt that says Elon University, like Elon Musk. I kind of want to cut it like super cropped, like literally like, like this, like smad short. I found this in the line when I was leaving. Amazing. I'm so happy I found this. And it is this cheetah print bikini top from Victoria's Secret. <laughs> Even like this with this black boyfriend jeans, Air Force. <laughs> Sorry, I was thinking about getting pink vans. What do you guys think? Do you guys think I should get pink vans? But yeah, that's everything I got at the thrift store. Dude, I feel so full. Like I'm dying right now. I really hope this doesn't get dirty fast. It's vibes, right? I like it. <coughs> Again, I'm so sorry. I do whatever I want, whenever I want. I love it. People keep talking, I just keep winning.